Fortnite World Cup champion Booga is so upset with the game now that he is saying things like, Hate this game. I hate it. Hate it. Hate it. But wait till you see what happened to him and you will see why he is so mad. Epic apparently lied to us. The pros are saying everywhere and this looks to be true. I'll let you know what they did in just a second. Pros and a lot of you guys are still wanting an FOV slider, but now people are actually cheating and hacking in an FOV slider in Fortnite. You won't believe what it looks like. Plus a lot more with Batman, of course, coming soon. And even a 74 year old who plays Fortnite has a message for us. Amazing video today. I'm your second favorite PE teacher, Denver. Tap the like button right now real quick for me and subscribe too for all Fortnite Pro news and updates. Now, before we get into all the big news today, this video is brought to you by my friends at Playvig, our amazing sponsor for today. And if you guys aren't using Playvig yet, you need to start now because you can get V-Bucks, skins, PS4 gift cards, and just about anything you would want for free. Yes, it's true. Just doing what you are doing now, and that's playing Fortnite or a bunch of other games that you might be playing. Compete in quests or leaderboards contests. You win tons of V-Bucks or just take it casual like I usually do and just play some Team Rumble games and still earn plenty of VIG coins. Just click the link in the description below, guys. Open up that Play VIG, create an account, and choose any quest that you feel like completing. And then and use your coins in the Playvig shop. That's it. It's 100% free. Like I said, if you aren't using it, you should start now. And I just like doing it for the leaderboards and quests. So the fact I get gift cards and skins for free just for playing Fortnite, I mean, that's pretty amazing. So help me out by clicking the link in the description below and downloading Playvig today. Now, this is just for my PC fam for now, but leave a comment if you guys do want to see Playvig come to Xbox or PS4 or more. All right, let's get into the big news for today. Epic lied about something in the patch notes. And as much as that might seem like clickbait or something, you guys know we don't do that here. Pros are very upset because Epic said one important thing thing in the new update yesterday that at first we all loved. Check this out and then we'll get to Booga and the FOV slider hacks. Epic said final storm circles will no longer occur at the following locations. Moisty, greasy, tilted, retail, and pressure plant. So everyone celebrated because doing the taco dance when you're stuck in the storm and then you die is pretty frustrating and shouldn't be a thing. So now you can see why Booga would be so mad among Plenty of other things too, of course. You guys are apparently getting this too. Like on Reddit, this picture blew up of a guy who won, but clearly in the last zone in Moisty. And then another one with the title, The Last Circle Will Not Be In A Rift Zone, mocking Epic for telling us that. Now watch what happened to Booga and why he said he hates the game over and over. And then we'll check out the FOV slider hacks people are using and they look insane. Wait till you see it. Take a look. Wait guys, don't worry. The new update says zones can't end here. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah. Got a pad early so I don't get taco timed. Oh, here we go. Woo! <laughs> Gotta get 50 50. Not yes. troll. You gross. Yo, Zypha, you watching my stream right now, Zypha? Yeah, I'm looking, I'm looking. Yeah, you like, like, this, you like the skin combo or what, bro? Yeah, that's just gross. You kind of look like uh, Demo. Yeah, that's what I was, that's what I was saying. I was like, you off the stick, dude. I don't, I don't know how the first is my shot. My sense is just way We're too going to Universal! And we're coming too! <laughs> you hear me? You hear me, know ya boy. No way. Do you believe in magic? I believe in taco time. Bro, I'll cap no job, I do believe. Job. You can win. No way no. you just died to that, Booga. No way you just died to that. This game's so dog. I hate this game too, Booga. It's all good. Dark what are we, what are we supposed to make a patch where that doesn't happen? What happened? What happened? I you literally placed in a taco time and I couldn't get out. It's so dog. It seems so dog. Yeah, what's up, that Denver guy? I just took the Loot Lake Rift and it put me at Lazy Lagoon and I just died a storm. <laughs> Say how dumb this game is. <laughs> Don't worry, Final Zone doesn't end there. Hate this game. I hate it. Hate it. Hate it. So that's your world champion millionaire Booga who blew up and is rich now only because of Fortnite. So is he right to say this or do you think he shouldn't say things like that? Let me know what you think and I can understand his frustration when Epic tells you specifically in the short patch notes that it will not happen and then it constantly happens and you die to it in a tournament. Did Epic lie or is this a mistake? And if it's a mistake, why has it not been fixed yet and they have no statement on it, especially when there 
their world champion is apparently hating the game partially because of this. Of course, when you do something that many hours a day all the time, you will probably just hate it regardless. But anyway, let's get to this FOV hack that people have been using first. Check it out. And then let me tell you what happened to some people who were caught using this. Check this out. So when he zooms out and then zooms back in, it makes our default FOV so small looking. And somebody who used this said that when they went back to the default, they actually got a little bit sick from it being so small and tight in around your character. So what do you think of this? And would you like to see this in the game? Benjamin on Reddit said, it is really easy to fix this problem. Just let everyone have an FOV slider. But Cool Sneaker said, what happened to these cheaters? Saying, I heard a lot of people got banned after 10.3 update for using it and seeing Master 44 replied, yeah, but you can just make a new account since it's a free game. I used it in an alt account playing pubs before, and that account still isn't banned. It's impossible to get back to default FOV. It will make you throw up for a few days days so use it at your own risk guys honestly i don't even know where to find it or if i did i don't even know if i'd want to use it because if you get used to another fov and you love it then you'll probably hate the default even more than you do now but tsm myth tweeted today saying fov slider pog and i guess this video is actually ducky the gamers a really talented mobile pro check this video out to see the fov mobile uses and then we'll check out what a 74 year old fortnite player said about, again, about the game take a look features nothing else is getting so um, a feature on iOS is that you can split screen apps. So what this means is you'll drag another app up, put it on the side of the screen so you can multitask it. What this does is changes the FOV of Fortnite. So you can either play super zoomed in or if you drag this out, you literally get like 120 FOV. Like I, I don't understand. This is I'm not I'm I'm not doing anything. I can walk around. My HUD is obviously super small and super messed up. But we now have insane reds. It's like one by one. That's like what my aspect ratio is. It's a square now. I literally have a one by one 1080 by 1080 freaking res on mobile. Dude, this is alpha. So honestly, that just looks so good and clean. You'd be able to see what you're doing. And so far, mobile is the only one to do this without the hacks, of course. But why does every game in the world have an FOV slider except for Fortnite just about? Do you guys think Fortnite should get one or should everybody have to use the default 80 except for mobile players? Let me know what you guys think on this. And while you do, listen to the 74-year-old Fortnite player tell you what he thinks about the terrible audio in this game something else epic should fix check this out oh baby they got me again before 11th you gotta get down and i thought it sounded this is a big problem too is with uh fortnite's audio system is very very poor unless you're rich and you've got the money to buy uh, the kind of computer that supports a 7.1 surround system and a good speaker setup or something uh you're the sound you can't tell where it's at most of the time now this is Grand 007 Pa, Grand 007 Pa. He streams on Twitch and YouTube pretty regularly. He's a great guy, so go show him some love and see if you can get in on one of his games sometimes. But for real, the audio in this game is just bad. Not even insulting. Nobody's complaining about it. Epic even knows it's bad, and they have promised to fix it for a really long time, especially hearing above and below you. But to this day, it is very hard to tell where somebody is most of the time. So I'm glad Grand is speaking up about it. But hey, big news and big Big update coming to Fortnite. You guys might have heard, uh, you know, from the million clickbait YouTube channels that have been saying this for a while, but they were actually right about this one. Batman is coming to Fortnite and it looks amazing. I'm not super into Batman or anything like that, but at Silux on Twitter shared with us from what I can see in Gotham City, you will have glider redeploy enabled with the string or phrase glide at will being referenced so that sounds super awesome will definitely help tilted feel like gotham city and then under that you can see he said a rift zone called the combine i don't know if it's combine or combine is coming that says welcome to the combine remember emote to start so whatever that can mean put what you think it is down in the comments tap like and sub if you guys haven't already code 
that Denver guy, YT, and make sure you check out PlayVig. Really cool system. You just play Fortnite, you watch a couple ads, and you get coins to be used for anything, really. Have a great day, guys, and I will see you guys in the next video. Love, Denver.